I'm Megan Vitt and I'm an assistant professor in biomedical engineering in the Penn State College of Engineering. Biomedical engineering integrates classical and modern engineering principles with the life sciences and healthcare to define and solve problems in biology, medicine, healthcare, and other related fields. Biomedical engineering students complete coursework in areas such as instrumentation, biomechanics, numerical simulations, advanced mathematics, and physiology. Biomedical engineers work in a variety of fields in the healthcare and pharmaceutical industries, including medical device development, diagnostic and therapeutic tool design, physiological system modeling, and the practice of medicine. Penn State Biomedical Engineering alumni are building next generation artificial hearts and medical implants, designing improved medical imaging devices, and creating better methods of drug delivery. They work in industry, medical organizations, and academia. Many have gone on to graduate or medical school. Penn State's Department of Biomedical Engineering is housed in the new Chemical and Biomedical Engineering Building, featuring 109,000 square feet of state-of-the-art lab space with leading-edge instrumentation and computing resources and a variety of collaborative learning spaces and classrooms for students. Biomedical engineering faculty are actively working with industry in the Penn State College of Medicine to advance biomedical research and improve healthcare, while also translating this expertise directly into the classroom to benefit our students. Biomedical engineers are only limited by the extent of their imagination. At Penn State BME, we develop problem solvers who are driven to develop novel, innovative healthcare solutions that impact millions of people. It was while I was here on a tour of the pre-medicine department that I started inquiring about some of these things. Like, at one point in your medical career, do you start to investigate how to make new things or how to make surgeries better, or how to do drug delivery or how to improve um, just patient care? And they said, you know, um, we don't really do that here. Go talk to the engineers. <laughs> so um, I came back and toured the biomedical engineering department here and fell in love with what I saw. Well, medicine is absolutely necessary for taking care of the whole person um, and that human interaction, engineers are the ones who move medicine forward, who develop the new technologies. Honestly, I really do love biomedical engineering. I think the thing that I love about it most is that it provides a lot of freedoms for the students in it. There are four distinct and really cool options in biomedical engineering, biochemical, biomechanical, biomaterial, and imaging. All of them offer a different flavor and a lot of cool, unique courses that people in that specific branch can take. I love the fact that it's a mixture of the other majors in a way because we take the same core courses um, like thermodynamics, fluids, uh, mechanics. So we get those courses from other engineering disciplines. We also learn computer science um, languages. So it's a mixture of everything, but it's just a specific application to medicine, which is what I'm passionate about. So the field that I'm in right now is assistive technology. And one of the coolest things that's happening right now is BCI or brain computer interface. So being able to control a computer without having to use, you know, your fingers or things like EMG, which is like muscle twitching, but actually being able to real time um, control a computer. So you think right away, okay, you know, what can that be used for? Maybe a really cool video game. Um, but for people that, you know, are paraplegic, that have disabilities, they can use that to communicate, to go to school. Uh, one of the things that I think is most interesting is our ability to use materials and drugs um, to engineer responses from the immune system. We sometimes want to suppress the immune system if we want to transplant some materials or we want to stop an allergic reaction, for instance. But in other cases, we want to encourage the immune system to attack something like in the case of cancer. All of these areas biomedical engineers can contribute to uh, quite effectively. And so it really is very exciting. We all know someone who has cancer, who has dementia, who has other diseases. And the nice thing about biomedical engineering is we aim to solve those. Whether it be someone you know or someone your friends know, that research does go into impacting people's lives. I hope to be able to find ways to make new products, new designs, new methodologies that can help individuals one by one on a daily basis. That's what biomedical engineering is to me. That's what the field of medicine is to me. That's what all of engineering is to me. And that's really what I want to do for someone else. 
on a daily basis, I get to see a spark that gets ignited, that gets students invigorated about the topics that they're studying and engaging with their coursework. We are Penn State Biomedical Engineering, and we are impacting our world.